Today I'm back at MC Sanya present Little News Years. Hey, hey you! Are you four? I am, and my name's Bram, and I'm four! And I'm Jake, Bram's dad, but some people call me Boxer Blue. Blah! And here is the news. Happy Pioneer Day, Bram. What? What's Pioneer Day? Oh, well, if you are from the Church of Latter-day Saints, then you know that Pioneer Day is the special day when Brigham Young and other people from the um, Church of Latter-day Saints, when they settled down in Salt Lake City. It's uh, a religious holiday for people sometimes known as Mormons. Oh, that's great. And today is July 24th, 2019. And here is the news for today. First thing we're going to tell you all about is that uh, they've done a study. It's pretty amazing, but basically people who are smoking cigarettes. Oh, I hate cigarettes are very bad for you. Yes, I know. This, they did something really weird. They paid people money to get them to stop. Uh, like they paid them like maybe less than a hundred dollars, sometimes more than seven hundred dollars just to stop smoking. And guess what? What? It worked. Oh my gosh. That's, that's so crazy, isn't it? Yes, it is. Doosh, doosh. Our next bit of uh, information is something that uh, uh, we talked about recently, and that's that uh, sugar is really not good for you. So um, we're, we're just going to tell you that why sugar is not good for you. So it can cause lots of problems. Here are some of them. Tooth decay. Bum, 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 bum. Tooth decay is when things can rot in your mouth. Your teeth can get all nasty. Obesity is another problem. Obesity is when you, you, you have a little too much weight. You're a little too big, and that can happen from eating too much sugar, too. Uh, a fatty liver disease is something also you could get. Uh, you could also get something like uh, diabetes, which is a very serious um, imbalance of uh, things in your body. And then also you can get heart disease and um, lots of bad things. So this is just a reminder not to eat so much sugar. Doosh, doosh. I'm now going to tell you some news about the United Kingdom. Once again, the United Kingdom. We always talk about them, don't we? Yes, we do. So uh, they have a brand new prime minister. His name is Boris Johnson. He has blondish hair and uh, he is a disruptor, just like our president, Donald Trump. What do you mean by disruptor? Disruptor is somebody who um, basically changes things. He says, I don't like this, and why do we do this, and who cares, let's just try this thing, and sometimes causes some problems. And so people are wondering if Donald Trump and Boris Johnson are both leaders, if that will cause some major disruption in the world, for better or worse. Doosh, doosh. Bram, have you ever heard of Gulalai Ismail? Uh, I don't think so. Gulalai Ismail is very very famous in Pakistan. She has, she's very outspoken. She, she speaks about women's rights issues, uh, how women should be empowered, and she's had audiences like Michelle Obama, the former, former first lady of the U.S., and Queen Elizabeth. Well, here's the scary thing. She is on the run in her native Pakistan. Wait a minute, wait a minute, Pakistan, Pakistan, where's Pakistan? Oh, oh, Pakistan is near India. Oh, oh, okay. And so, uh, basically, even though she, Gulalai Ismail is a revered feminist. Feminist? Feminist is a person who strongly believes that women and men should have the same rights. Do you believe that, by the way, Bram? I do. If I had a sister, I would treat her just like I treat myself. Oh, oh, okay, that, that's interesting. But anyway, she is on the run, um, and, and that's a little bit scary, I think. Doosh, doosh. So this is really cool. There's this brand new satellite. It's called a LightSail 2. Uh, it's designed by California scientists. And basically it's a satellite that goes into space and is powered by the sun. So the idea is if this works, if LightSail 2 works, then um, one day maybe we can send spaceships into space and not have to use you know, jet fuel and rocket fuel and things like that. We can just use the power of the sun, and then maybe we can more easily also go to places like Zuzania. Oh, uh, that's a little more complicated. Okay, that's all we have to say today. I want to tell everybody that if you're having a bad day out there, just hang tough. Tomorrow will probably be better. My dad tells me that every day, and it always makes me feel good. Okay, so have a great day. Do you want this week's news? Go to littlenewsears.com. Don't forget to check out our videos on YouTube.com and our teacher lesson plans and more on LittleNewsEars.com. May your sweetness shine and your colors glow. Blah. 
Sources for today's broadcast include the New York Times, Nautilus, Mental Floss, NBC News, and ABC News.